Hey, what's up, bros? NZ Glitcher here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another GTA 5 online video. This GTA 5 online video, I'm going to be showing you, bros, how to get custom plates. And I'm going to be also showing you, bros, how to get custom plates. Or, sorry, how to use the iFruit app, I guess, if your phone is, like, too new. Um, because a lot of new phones can't use the iFruit app because GTA is so slack and they haven't actually updated their iFruit app. So a lot of um, phones that are new, the app kind of just crashes. So I'm basically going to be showing you a different way or a better way or a way I like to use the iFruit app. But anyway, to start off with this method, you want to make sure that you um, have a vehicle out on the map. So have a vehicle out on the map that you know that you've driven around a lot. So I like to use the technical aqua um, to make custom plates because it's easy to request out of the interaction menu and yeah if anyone like blows up or anything like that you can just like get it straight back out from the interaction menu like after you wait for the timer but you bros don't have to go and request the technical aqua you can just use a normal car like I said just make sure you've driven it around a lot so it registers that you've driven it around a lot like in the iFruit app and just make sure you know what that car is and you do have it out on the map. So once you've done that, we're going to head over to the computer. And once you bros are on the computer, uh, you're going to want to go to your Chrome browser. And then when you're in the Chrome browser, click on the top search bar up here and type in bluestacks.com forward slash download. And right there, you'll find the download link for bluestacks once you load up bluestacks.com forward slash download you will see download bluestacks 5 right here so you bros want to go ahead and download that if you haven't yet i've already downloaded it um, so we're going to go ahead and click into that so open up bluestacks and let's get started Once you bros get into Bluestacks, this is what it looks like. It's kind of like a phone on your computer. So you're going to be able to go into the Play Store and you'll notice once you go into the Play Store, type in the search bar up here, iFruit or iFoot like I did, and it should come up the GDA iFruit app. Okay, so it's telling me I need to update mine. You don't really need to update it. It's not necessary. I'm not going to worry about it. So yeah, we won't worry about updating it. But you want to install or download and install the iFruit app. Once you bros have done that, it should be on your Bluestacks emulator. And then you want to click on the iFruit app. So if you bros are trying to sign in and the app is crashing, this is what I want to talk about because the app is crashing for a reason. Okay, all of you are aware of car duplications and dirty dupes. So if you have sold a dirty dupe, basically this app will crash when you go to sign in. So if you go to put your email address in here, so we'll go ahead and punch our email address in. So the email address I'm putting in now is from a GTA account. I know that I have sold a dirty dupe. We're going to go ahead and sign in. Once we click sign in, it's just sort of going to load a little bit and it will load up the iFruit app. But then when you go ahead and click on Los Santos Customs, so we'll click on that and we'll click through all of these screens here. It's just going to like load for a little bit, but it ain't going to fully load. It's just going to sort of load for a bit. And then it's going to crash and you'll be back looking at Bluestacks like this. So this is because that email address or that account that I tried to sign into just then, uh, I'm not allowed to go on Los Santos Customs in the iFruit app in there because I've sold a dirty dupe. So now if I go ahead and backspace this email and type in another email, which I know should be good, and then when we type that email in and go ahead and sign in, 
it's obviously going to sign us into the iFruit app. We can go ahead and click on Los Santos Customs and click through all these screens here. And this time it is going to actually load us in. So if it's crashing on you, it's got nothing to do with the app. It's actually your account. Okay, you've got dirty dupes, but don't worry. I've got a video coming up right after this one. Tell you bros how you can fix that one. So you can buy or sorry, make custom plates on that account again. But anyway, we're going to just go ahead and make a custom plate on this account. So yeah, we can show you bros how to make custom plates in GDA 5 online. All right, so we've got to look for that technical aqua, obviously. I know that I've driven it around for a while in GDA online, so it's definitely going to be on this list. And here it is right here. So we want to go ahead and just um, select this car right here. So just click it, and now we'll be looking at this car in the customization. So when we're looking at this car in the customization, you notice this number plate at the top, which was the number plate at the beginning of the video on the car that we were looking at. So we're gonna go ahead and just add a new plate and we can type in whatever we want here. So we're just gonna type in custom and then hit enter if you're on PC. Okay, if you're doing this on your phone because you've managed to get the app working on your phone, um, just type it in there obviously and then just click off of the number plate. And then you want to click customize and it'll say your number plate was changed successfully. From here, you bros just need to click order and then accept. It's going to cost you 100k. Now, as you see, it's ordered for the technical aqua. So that's perfect. That's the card that we have out on the map in GTA 5 online at the moment. So after we've selected all of these, we're just going to cross off all this and we're done with this app now. We can head back over to GTA 5 online and wait for our text from the LSC. So like I said, once you bros get back over there to GTA 5 online, you should have that text from the LSC saying to go and pick up your order. So I'm going to open my interaction menu and request my technical aqua. Or if you use a personal vehicle, you want to open up your interaction menu and you want to request that personal vehicle which you brought the custom plate for okay so for me i'm going to hop in my technical aqua and just going to take this technical aqua into the lsc all right so once you bros get in here if you damage the vehicle it's obviously going to say repair the vehicle but then if it doesn't it's just going to say process app order. But either way, after you repair the vehicle anyway, it's going to say this. You're just going to press X to accept that. And then after you accept that, you notice that the custom plate is on. And it says custom. So there you go. So that's how you make custom plates in GTA 5 online. And if you bros have a new phone, that is how you do it uh, without a phone. You can start it up on your PC. You just download BlueStacks from www.bluestacks.com forward slash download and you can get it straight from there. Um, just make sure you have a PC for that one or a laptop or something. So now you can go ahead and make um, all the custom plates that you want. Although I think there is a limit, but yeah, you can make all the custom plates you want. Just a warning, do not purchase any custom plates on cars that have Yankton plates because you will lose it when you collect the order. I'm NZG, I'll catch you in the next one.